Uh, hello, my name is Charles Wright and I'm with Master Color Labs. We created this video for anyone that might have found us on a social networking site, whether it be Facebook, uh, LinkedIn, or possibly on Twitter. Um, we're a photo finishing lab in Greensboro, North Carolina, and we have a number of options for you to upload your images to us and let, allow us to print for you. So um, on the right-hand side of the page here, there's our Rose software, which is our most popular. Um, the 123 works as more of a checkout process, so you can have um, a PayPal checkout process at the end. Uh, you can upload a few images at a time. It's not recommended if you're sending a whole uh, bunch of different images just for uploading speed. The Easy File Uploader is designed more for professionals that are sending large folders with 50 to 100 files in it, or for someone that's wanting to order something that's not listed as a standard size in our Rose software. We also have an iPhone app that allows you to order pictures on the go, which is pretty handy on vacations and things like that when you don't think you'll get around to it once you get home. But um, I recommend most people using our Rose order system here. And to do that, you just click on Learn More. And it's going to take you to the Rose page. It also starts to launch the Rose software, which takes about two minutes. So I'm going to bypass that since uh, we want to keep this video as short as possible. Uh, once the software loads on your computer, uh, which is nice because now this is the software working on your computer rather than you uploading all your images to a, a, a third-party site and then selecting the ones you want after you've uploaded. It's just a, a, a big savings in uploading time. Uh, we've created a number of videos here for you to watch for different products that we offer such as canvas galley wraps or greeting cards. Um, but just to get started ordering pictures, which is what we do for 90% of our business, just click on start ordering up here on the right hand side. Um, and what will come up is our start page, and then on the left-hand side it shows our different items and sizes. Uh, it comes to standard print since that's what we mostly sell, but greeting cards are also very popular, and you can scroll over and find where we have our, um, our composites and also our canvas gclay prints. This is where the canvas gallery wraps are located. Those are also very popular. Um, but once you're just on our standard sizes, um, let's pick an 8x10 since there's a severe crop there. And this will be our workspace. Now we need to get our images, which I recommend having on a folder on your desktop. The software will allow you to go find them on a CD or a USB drive hooked to your computer, but the uploading speeds will decrease dramatically if you're working from a folder with on your desktop. So to find some images to order, you just go click Add Image Folder. So it's going to now open up this window to go find the images on your computer. PCs look slightly different, but pretty much the same process as the Mac. I uploaded some created a folder called April the 5th. And then the images will appear on the right-hand side of the screen here. Um, you can use this zoom bar here to make the, large, the images larger in case you have some that are very similar and it'll help you differentiate which is which. Um, but we've selected that we want an 8x10 and now we sip, simply just go over and drag, our drop, drag and drop our image over into the workspace. You can double click but I have found sometimes that can cause interference within your computer operating system and lock up your computer. Um, real simple, it's a nice shot here, it's a little uh, off-center, it's not quite level, so you can adjust that either using 90 degree angles by simple clicks here, or, let's get it back to where we started, you can use this, this arrow on the right hand side, it gives you, allows you to straighten it up varying degrees and not just the 90 degree option. Oops, so let's go here. <clears throat> you can also, within this tool, zoom and this is how you crop your images. You use the zoom bar and then you just click on your image and shift it accordingly to the, once you have it the way you like it. And once you do, click off the image and you just add it to your cart down here at the bottom. Um, you can do this with any, you can also, just to show you, can add it, make it a black and white just by clicking over here on the images. Um, we also have, we can add different borders. Uh, we have some we call our sloppy borders, um, various ones here. Or if you want to create a vignette on your picture, let me get rid of this border, um, you can add different vignettes. The vignette color will be different if you choose your background color. Right now it defaults to white, but most people would make it black to burn in the edges, is what most people do. Um, so that's kind of handy, nice professional look to your print. And we'll go back to color. And then we've added this one now to our cart. So let's go review our items here. And it'll show you, I ordered one before we added the vignette. It shows you your quantity and your price. If you want to change anything, you can hit your edit tool and go back to that item. Or you can delete it out of your, um, out of your cart. Um, once you've 
like everything and you approve it, you just go complete and send order. And you'll enter your credit card information. And then also you can choose to pick up and pay or how you want us to ship the order to you. So if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at 1-800-252-1042. And thanks for clicking on our link. And we hope to be connected with you in the future. Thanks.